a pretty sweet battle. This doesn't look too good.
here! Quite clever, wouldn't you say? Using mirrors to reinforce the seal. Stop! You mustn't break the seal.
this!
go. Here you go. Looks like it worked. I appreciate your help and your gift. You 
won't be needing this. Oh no! The pendant! Huh? That stone... Could it be... Hey! Wait! Callus! Mizuri's hurt! Oh no! Hey, Mizuri! You alright? Hey! Our ancestor, the one who found the End Magnus in the Mystical Garden, left records of his findings. They claim that the five End Magnus are the remains of a dead god, taken apart and buried separately. What? The corpse of a deceased god? That's awful! Now it all makes sense! The names of the N. Magnus are Le, Che, Ba. They must be named according to each body part. Arms, legs, chest, body. A god's powers are retained in its remains long after death. The five N. Magnus were infused with the power of an evil god. So that's what the curse was all about. The fifth and final End Magnus must be the head of Malpertio. Looking at how the other Magnus have been named, number five must be called He. Exactly. And the fifth End Magnus is buried somewhere in Alfard, Empire of the Flame. So that's why, back in Inua Inua, the light from the End Magnus pointed towards both Mira and Alfard. The end Magnus here had been unsealed, but was enclosed underground with magic. It was not fully awakened. That must be why the light indicated both islands. Alfard, Empire of the Flame. There's no turning back now. Let us go to Alfard. Yeah, I second that. Giacomo must have headed back to the Empire. Let's go. We'll take him out on his own turf. Right on. Let's teach them a lesson. I'm with you. We need to stop out Gelda Blame's ambitions. Let's go. Off to find and protect the final end, Magnus. The Empire shouldn't be underestimated. We have to reclaim all the end Magnus they stole, bury them, and put the god back to rest. If only we could ease his hatred. Hmm. Now that you're awake, tell me, Great Mizuti, who are you anyway? To know who the great Mizuti be? The great Mizuti be great. Simple. The great Mizuti also happens to be a child of the earth, here to defeat the wicked god. Hmm. Well, thanks for letting us know. Go back to sleep for a little while. You'll need your beauty rest, okay? does not seem to believe the Great Mizuti's words. Of course I do. I trust you. The Great Mizuti is going to defeat the Wicked God, right? That makes six of us. Really? Really? Yep. Really and truly. We're a team now. Okay, then. Remember one thing. The Great Mizuti sometimes needs to tell lies, but you should never lie to the Great Mizuti. Never. Remember. Okay, okay, Great Mizuti. We won't lie to you. Right? That must be the name of your invisible friend. The Great Mizuti gives the voice to you. 
The great Mizuti acknowledges you. It's great to have you with us again, Mizuti. All for one. One for all. So, how are we going to get inside the Empire? I can take you there with my ship. I've made quite a number of visits to the Empire. They know my ship and should let us into port easily enough. Thank you, milady. That would be a great help. Wouldn't that be dangerous for you, Lady Melodia? No need to worry. I'll pass the time somehow and head back alone. There's nothing dangerous about it. Sounds like a plan. You should all get a good night's rest and set off tomorrow. Callus, you're still awake. Could we talk for a minute? Sure. Something wrong, Shella? Can't you sleep? I've been thinking about the prophecy that the old lady told us the other day. Should they be unsealed, all five evils unleashed, our world would succumb to the everlasting curse of the evil god Melpercio. Melpercio will never be restored to his full might, for the Guardians destroyed his evil in its entirety. However, should the white-winged darkness alight upon this land, the world will disappear without a sound, swallowed by a maelstrom of chaos. Our only hope is the ocean long lost. Find us, O oh mighty ocean, and forgive us. The white-winged darkness, the long-lost ocean, Callus, I... Yeah? What's wrong? Never mind. It's not important. Tomorrow, we set off for Alfard, part of Imperial Might. Yeah. What will become of us? I... I mean us all. The entire world, of course. Huh? Yeah, well, to tell you the truth, I just don't know, Shella. What may happen, what future awaits us, I don't even know what'll happen to me. <sighs> Callus, let's do our best, for everyone's sake, okay? I believe in you. Good night. Shella? What do you think? You think someone stole our end Magnus? Is there really a traitor among us? Is someone lying? You think so? Kinda sad, isn't it? Find us, almighty ocean, and forgive us. Savina. Hmm? Say we manage to sneak into the Empire. Then what? We need to track down Geldoblame and Giacomo. They should be on their way to finding the last End Magnus. We have to catch up with them somehow. I guess you're right. We'll be on enemy turf. Chasing them down while trying to stay hidden. That'll be tough to pull off. What are the odds of us winning? No idea. We'll just have to try and see. Ain't that the truth. By the way, about the Lost End Magnus, you think it was one of us that... It's very likely. 
But who could have done it? Don't know. It could be Liud. Or it could be me. Or it could be you. We'll find out when we get to the Empire. Yeah. The time has come to return to Alfard. Will I be able to confront my own people? The friends and family I grew up with. Would I be able to face them in battle if I had to? Why did it have to come to this? Emperor Gelderblame, does he truly intend to unleash the power of Mount Persio in this world? That pendant, that must be the one my ancestor left behind with his records. How did it come to be in Gelderblame's possession? The gate to Ba has been opened. Now only one door remains. To this world, he will summon the core Hydra, Bastion of Evil, banished to another dimension, and the countless creatures within, finally released from exile. The world will die a slow and painful death. It is almost here. Just a little longer. <laughs> How should our nations deal with this mess? We must be ready to wage an all-out war against the Empire, should it become necessary. There have been no reports thus far that the Empire is amassing its forces. War must be avoided at all costs. But once all the End Magnus are unsealed, and the power of the Wicked God is unleashed, it would be too late. I understand that. Yet, King Laticon... I bring a message for your highness. Callus and his party plan to leave Mira and head for the Imperial capital. Is that right? Hmm... I suggest we wait just a little longer. If they succeed in recovering the End Magnus and in stopping Geldeblame's scheme, it may be unnecessary to act. But you think they can take care of it alone. The fate of the world is at stake here. One wrong move could lead to grave consequences. Then we should be prepared to act and wait for word from them. I have faith in that young man bonded with the Guardian Spirit.